Hey golf people, I'm right outside of playbetter.com and we're gonna get a behind the scenes tour here. We're gonna learn everything about what they do here, all the new golf products that are being released this year, some of the hidden gems in golf technology that you should know about, and we're gonna get to meet the team. I thought this was a super cool opportunity to actually meet the founders and the folks that are behind all the cool golf technology we talk about on this show. And we're 10 minutes away from my childhood home here in Baltimore, so it's like a homecoming as well. Let's go inside and meet the team. This is it. Welcome. <laughs> guys, this is Chris. Hey Tell us what you do here, man. I'm director of growth here at Play Better. We got some of the team working hard. Hi. What are you, what are you working on? Um, just getting out some emails to customers. Hello. How about you guys? <laughs> we are processing orders. All uh, right. This little one's daycare is closed today, so she's helping. <laughs> <laughs> nice. We're going to find the boss. The boss is over here somewhere, too. How long ago did you guys uh, start this thing? Uh, we started in 2008. Wow. So yeah, it's been a while. You've but seen some crazy stuff come we've through We've seen then. everything come through <laughs> We're going to explore some of that today, if you don't mind. So yeah. we're going to look at kind of how Playbetter got started. We're going to look at some of the new products out on the market and some stuff that we should be looking for maybe as the year progresses. For someone like me, this is like being at Disneyland because on these shelves is like everything you could ever think of golf technology wise. Let's start with like maybe how you got started. like. I know there's a cool story about the first products you ever stocked at Playbetter. This was our first big seller. This is called the Swing Setter um, from back in the day. Um, so these release, it, it's a fantastic product, it still is. David um, Ledbetter, right? David Ledbetter, yep. This is called Club Face Golf, um, which um, I won't comment on the uh, effectiveness of this particular tool, um, but, <laughs> but it's, uh, uh, it helps you line up uh, with the different colors. Um, it didn't work for me, but hopefully it worked for some, <laughs> Let me take some a look other at this golfers. Thing. Let me see this thing. <laughs> All right, so you've got this like big panel on there, and if your if your club face is squared impact, you're going to get the nice yellow, which you'd think that would be green. Like if it was me, I'd admit, I'd probably make that green. If you're going to hook it, if you're coming through, you got the hook, and there you've got the slice. <laughs> so uh, I guess it does what it says on the tin, huh? <laughs> Yeah, um, and then this is a little funny one. Uh, it's called Step Into Golf, uh, which we clearly have not unwrapped it yet. Ooh, <laughs> but um, it has a little uh, foothold in the back of it where um, supposedly a an adult teaching a kid how to golf can put their foot and point it in the right direction. <laughs> so um, not one of our top sellers, but still one that we'd like to right. keep around because um, we have fond memories of it. That's awesome. <laughs> it's cool that they keep all this stuff because this is how they got started. Yeah. And, and actually uh, with, the, with the story that you were talking about, um, it's when we, when we really got into golf technology um, and our start actually was right here. Um, so this is the uh, Garmin Approach S2. Um, which is, gosh, I mean, we were probably selling it in 2011. Um, and I still remember the day we were in a small office in Baltimore City, didn't have heat. <laughs> and, Jeez. Um, we bought six of these from Garmin wow. uh, in the black red version. Um, and I was panicking. I didn't think that we would ever in a million years be able to sell these six watches. Um, and we've we've grown to where we are today, which we, we sell more than six watches. <laughs> um, but I see we, a stack of like Garmin stuff down there. Yeah, we have stacks of it now, but um, but this is where we started um, uh, with the S2. So this this will always have a prime spot in the, the Play Better Museum. Oh, right now it's just unfortunately living in this little red bin. <laughs> we'll get a nice display case for you soon. <laughs> we got a lot of things to do, Gabe. Okay? Show me some of the good stuff though. All right, that's how they got started, obviously, but this place has come a long way. We're going to meet the shipping team in just a second, but I mean, I'm almost overwhelmed by the amount of different items and in inventory, the SKUs and like just the cool stuff that I want to play with. So how many things are you guys stocking? Like how many SKUs do you guys have, Chris? We probably have about 500 active SKUs. Um, more than that of some inactive products that um, kind of live in the corner over there. Sure. <laughs> um, but maybe if we have a fire sale one day, we can um, get a room, but about 500 SKUs. Um, and we're lucky enough, we work with amazing brands like Garmin and Bushnell and Sky Golf and uh, Koros and Polar on the fitness side. Um, and we're, we are extremely lucky that we just have such high quality products from one end of the warehouse to the other. So yeah. you can see it right here. Oh, we're gonna look, we're gonna dive a little bit deeper here, but. We got someone shipping something right now. Hi, yeah, I'm packing. <laughs> What's your name? I'm Casey. Casey? Yeah. All right, so it's not like a machine. This is not Amazon. <laughs> There's robots. Literally, Casey is packing your order for you. Casey, how many 
How many of these do you put on a day? How many orders boxes are going out the door? Oh, at least a hundred a day. At least a hundred a day. I bet Monday's your biggest day. Oh yeah, Monday we have like over four hundred orders. What we got there? <laughs> Amiibo Plus. <laughs> All right, someone's happy. <laughs> Yay! Someone's gonna be very happy. Very very happy. This is look at this a whole box just of Amiibo Pluses. <laughs> Where are we right now? We are in Return Island, the land of the returns. Um, this is everything that comes in. I'm the mainland. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. And that's the mainland. This is the mainland. Our sign as well. Return Island's open, so back in business. <laughs> have you gotten anything like crazy in the box that shouldn't have been there? Like. Yeah, I think my favorite's been cat food. We've gotten that twice. So, <laughs> twice? Same person that, or new, a different person? I think it was two different people. <laughs> so that was a fun one. Anyone ever just try to like try to cheat the system too, like send yeah. something in that wasn't wasn't actually supposed to be a return. We did get some strobe lights though that I'm gonna take home and put on my rooftop. So that was <laughs> that was another personal favorite too. That's one cool thing about playbetter.com is they've got a hassle-free 60 day guarantee where you can just, if you don't like it, send it back. They'll send you something you do like, which is really cool. That's one down, 99 one to go. Yeah. <laughs> There's a lot of golf technology moving here at Playbetter. <laughs> And there's probably going to be a lot more because you're bringing on some new brands too, right? Can, are. are you allowed to talk about it yet? Um, sure. We're <laughs> <laughs> exclusive on Let's Play Through here. <laughs> so we're excited that in the next couple of weeks, um, we're going to bring on Foresight Sports, um, who carries uh, the legendary GC Quad, uh, GC3, GC Hawk. Um, so we're so excited to bring them on. Um, they're the industry leaders in launch monitors. So um, that's that's one that's going to be hopefully happening in the next couple of weeks that, that we're very excited about. Just to give you like a little perspective on that, like it's not easy to get that sort of a contract. You, you can't just be a company right off the street and say, hey, Foresight, I want to start stocking your items. Doesn't work that way, does it? It doesn't, and and you know, with a brand, I mean, they're industry leaders. They're they are the absolute best, and rightfully so. They are discerning about who they work with, and and we work extremely hard every day to make sure that the customer experience we're providing is second to none. Um, and fortunately, um, we were able to to convey that to them, and um, I'm very excited to to reward their trust um, by uh, uh, shipping a lot of those units. That's awesome. All right, well, I want to dive into some of this stuff. I mean, look at how much Garmin stuff there is. Like, we saw the S2. How many watches are there now? <laughs> one that I was really excited about was the Epics. Do you have one of those here somewhere? So, oh, here it is. Epics Black Titanium. There we go, yeah. Oh, yeah, the white titanium. There's the there white go. titanium. Yeah, There's this black this looks like it's sold out. Sadly, got empty, yeah. <laughs> but I actually have one here on my wrist. There you um, go. So this is the yeah, this is the new Garmin watch, and and as is the case with a lot of products right now, they're hard to get, and so we are. Um, yeah, what's it been like with the pandemic? Because like we know we had problems with uh, getting the R10 and some of these other devices that you would love to be shipping if you could. Yes. But there's been there's been issues. How how has that been challenging as a company just to be able to serve the needs of your customers? Yeah, so I mean we've gotten much better at taking pre-orders um, because that's um, really become the way for the most popular products for the R10, for the Epix, for the Phoenix, for all of the most popular products. Um, the demand is so intense. Um, that really in order to get one, you kind of have to get in line. And so we've had to become good at taking those pre-orders, but then managing uh, the, the expectations with those customers as delays happen or whatever. But we're, we're so fortunate that we work with Garmin who is braving these uncharted waters in amazing fashion. Like, yes, they are back order on things, but it's way better than a lot of companies. Um, and so we've just had to adjust what we do, but you know, so is everyone in this time. Yeah. Absolutely. And I mean, I think one of the major advantages that Playbetter has right now is the fact they're getting some stuff that a lot of people aren't getting because they've built these relationships over the years. Because you bought those six Garmin watches back in the day, <laughs> you're now getting, you know, you're getting inventory that a lot of these companies aren't able to get, which is really cool. All right, I'm, I'm walking away from Chris here because I'm just enthralled with all this stuff here. I looked at this one earlier this year. You might have seen my review on the Cool Shot Pro Stabilize 2. You've got all sorts of Garmin things here. We've got the Ernest Sports ESB1. You might not know it, but Play Better actually does a lot of things with fitness as well as 
uh, hunting and all sorts of outdoor sports. You've even got like ski stuff here. We do, yeah. We have a whole wall of ski helmets from Smith Optics, uh, Dekine. We have all sorts of um, really great um, outdoor products. So yeah, it's um, we've expanded from golf. We started with golf, but we're definitely now more into in fitness. And I wanted to show you this one because th you did a recent video oh, on this. Yeah. This is a great product. Um, the Pro Alex Plus uh, by Shotscope. It's, it's such a unique little product um, and for the price point it's hard to beat that. If you haven't seen the video I'm going to put a card to it right there a little link and you can check it out because what, what's cool about it is it's not only a GPS handheld device it's also a rangefinder all in one it's magnetic and it's super cool. Uh, voice caddy you, there's going to be this is like the wall of voice caddy stuff here. I actually did a review on this one guys it's coming on the channel in about two weeks this is the T9 this is their new watch it's a great price point and this thing does a couple of things really well including giving you green maps uh and literally putt views while you're on course so look out for that video because it's going to be a really good one um let's look at some other uh, this is like garmin world over here um so again you've got some uh, obviously a bunch of golf watches you've got their fitness watches you've got all sorts of they got everything including dog collars for all you dog owners out there if you want to make sure that your dog doesn't wander outside the fence, your hunting dog is uh, properly trained. Who knew that you could actually buy it at playbetter.com? Yeah. Including the be beautiful blue version as well. Oh, check this out, Gabe. Whoa, we just found something pretty awesome. The Launch Pro. I've been doing a couple of videos on this. This is actually what's in my simulator studio right now. Chris, why is this such a big item? This is an amazing product. Um, it is, it's made so it's Bushnell, but it's powered by Foresight Sports, who we just talked about. So you have the amazing technology that's built into all the Foresight products um, with you know this Bushnell brand that, that everyone has grown to trust over the years. So you can attest to this. It is ridiculously accurate. Um, the simulation is amazing. It's really easy to use. It's, it is one of the most exciting releases we've had in a long time. That's awesome. Just another one of the great things that they sell here. We've got golf clubs. I mean, this is a, if you're looking for co Cobra drivers, Wilson drivers, there's all sorts of things there. If you ever wondered about, you know, what happens if you do return it, you use their 60 day money back guarantee. Well, here's all the returned items. You guys do a lot of like open box items as well that you can buy. We inspect um, all the returns that come in and anything that was returned as a gift. There was literally just the box opened. Um, it gets a little green sticker, as you can see over there and um, we sell them at a great discount. Um, so those are often really great options for somebody who's looking to get into, especially one of the higher end products, um, may not want to pay as much. Yeah, and so you can find all those deals on their website. There's actually a couple of secret things there I'm not even allowed to show you, but there's some awesome stuff. Check Playbetter's website from time to time and you'll see some really good deals there that you might not have known about. Now, I didn't even realize that Playbetter did this, but we've got all sorts of balls here. We've got Volvic. We've got Tiger Woods Bridgestone balls there. Look at Tiger, look how happy he is to play that ball. You could be playing that ball too. <laughs> <laughs> What's something that people don't know about, Chris, that they should know about, or a piece of technology that would be interesting um, that more golfers need to know about? So there's a couple uh, that come to mind. Um, and I'm gonna group two products into one, and it's really, the AI functionality of a couple of our products, one being the Arco smart sensors and the app that comes with that. And then the other um, being um, the functionality that comes with the Garmin at Approach S62, which is the current highest end uh, golf watch that we carry. And basically what it does is it learns over time how you play, how what your tendencies are, how, how far you hit your certain clubs. And in certain situations, let's say you're 180, out from a water hazard, the green's just on the other side. Um, it will talk you down from your worst tendencies based on your previous behavior, which is something that is, that's a very powerful thing. It is, I mean, it is an AI caddy um, that's with you at all times. So that's something that is, is really, really cool. Um, and then a favorite of Spiro, our owner, is the Garmin Approach Z82, which is the, the range finder. And it's hard to, to fully express how cool this product is without sticking your eye up to it, which you've done. Um, but it's, I mean, Spiro describes it as like being a golf terminator. Like you, you, you put your eye up to it and it's a digital rendering. So it's kind of like the screen that you would have on your golf watch, um, but on steroids and through the range finder. Um, so you have an overlay of all the data that you need, the wind, it's, it's, it's 
unbelievable. And so that it, it's an expensive rangefinder, but it is um, one of the coolest, most innovative products we've ever carried. Yeah, it's almost, I describe it almost like augmented reality, right? Like it's not only just what you're looking at, but so much more layered on top of that as well. So, I mean, there's, that's what always gets me excited about golf technology is first of all, the pace of innovation we keep seeing quickening like new products are rolling out every couple of months here you guys are getting new SKUs in but um for devices like this this is stuff that like mere mortals like you and me never had access to data that we never could have dreamed was available and literally have a virtual caddy on your watch with a garmin product or on your uh, phone with the arcos product that stuff's really cool so chris what are the big plans for play better here as the year progresses or we got a lot of fun stuff going on. <laughs> um, I mean, the golf season's really heating up, obviously. And, you know, one of the things that happened um, during 2020 and 2021 is that a lot of people picked up golf. That's, you know, it was one of the only things that we could do during those times. Um, and so there's a lot more people playing now. Um, and it is a much busier time for us in the industry. So um, we're getting ready for that. Father's Day is big for us. Um, and believe it or not, uh, we're thinking about the holidays already. Wow. <laughs> it's, serious uh, planning. Spiro. Yes. What are you most proud of about what's what's happened here over the last decade and a half? I'm proud about the uh, the fact that we've built a, a team that cares about customers, that we've gone from not being able to um, get into certain booths at the PGA show to now being a top uh, five uh, retailer for those same brands uh, just uh, less than 10 years later. So a uh, lot to be proud of, but mostly the fact that we provide customers with no hassle experiences when it comes to buying, returning, um, and improving their game. Dude, thank you for the tour. Thank sure. you for showing me and around. We have a little gift for you, actually. Oh. Um, I don't know if you've seen this logo before. Oh my um, gosh! But uh, probably have. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but this, um, this, we just happen to have this. Let's get that thing off my head and so put this one on. It might be too. There we go. Oh yeah, oh, fits yeah. like a glove. That is amazing. They even know my size. <laughs> oh my god. Guys, that's playbetter.com, and you can see it's not some big, giant operation with suits and, you know, <laughs> thankless robots. These are real people that are helping you out, and of course, when you purchase your gear at playbetter.com, you also help support this show, so I hope you do that as well. Thanks for joining me today, and I'll catch you back here on another edition of Let's Play Through.